Hello and welcome to the East Point video newsletter and it's uh, the end of February it's the 26th I think it is and we are here outside the football pitch and the tennis court the reason I thought I'd start this video off with the uh, this in this location is because we have just finished a complete refurbishment of the tennis and football area so have a look at that new tennis surface it's pretty nice and in addition to that we have also I don't know if you can see it up up, up there we've we've completely replaced the overhead netting and the side netting and then in addition to that what we have done is replaced all of the side panels in the uh, the football pitch so if you look in behind me there you'll see all of this new black boards they're all brand new um, the old stuff had gone rotten so between the new nets above and the side nets and the new boards and everything like that this is spanking new it's in great shape and it looks really really good and um, the football pitch actually the one thing that we're missing is a new set of goal posts if you have a look there those are kind of old goal posts they're temporary um, we've actually ordered new ones so that everything will be new and the only thing that's left to say is I got an email today of all days from Hannah and uh, she's working in the park here and she came back with a suggestion that could we put in a basketball hoop somewhere in the park great idea Hannah if you're watching uh, we're going to look into that I just don't know how these surfaces work for basketball um, usage so it might be that we can't do it here but we're gonna have a look around and see if it's possible and um, keep the suggestions coming and uh, yeah I'm gonna take this video inside come on in the office here and uh, there's a couple of things I want to cover first of all apologies for the length of time it's taken for me to get this video out I've been trying to um, catch up and uh, but it's we're now eight weeks into the new year I'd hope to get a video out in January and I'd hope to get one out earlier than in the month in February um, just it's been extremely busy the refurbishment projects there's various other things going on in the park um, one thing I'd like to bring up straight away is coronavirus uh, something that I'm very conscious of and I'm getting posters made to go and put up in the uh, buildings and around the place in your offices but if anyone has hand sanitizers wall mounted hand sanitizers I think they may be a good idea to uh, to put into your offices if you can do that We're still running. I'm not sure I can still keep it up now when it seems like you have moved on I've got to try we're doing great on the uh, YouTube subscribers we're at 250 now and it's up a lot since when we started these videos and I just like to thank you all for doing that anyone who hasn't subscribed already I'd really appreciate if you can hit the subscribe button and the little bell below and um, and just you know it shows our support and it just means that you get these videos directly to your feed rather than me having to send emails out and things like that um, the next thing I'd like to say is that I am working on launching a podcast and it's going to be the East Point podcast and it's going to be the uh, 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 an audio version of these videos and um, they'll probably run a little bit longer um, explaining maybe in a little bit more detail and also we're thinking about having possibly conversations with occupiers here in the park and just you know a little bit of interest for those of you who might be interested in podcasts. I know it's becoming a big uh, medium that a lot of people are starting to listen to. Okay, another thing I want to cover is a the park upgrade. Um, about two weeks ago, I think it is now. No, it's actually 
three or four weeks ago, I did a presentation to all of the occupiers, uh, facility managers in the in the park, and um, I presented uh, a big a presentation with a lot of boards like this one here that um, were outlining what our plans are for the park and um, what the plan is to actually start in the summertime with the with work that will actually basically lead to bicycle lanes going in in the central core of the park and we're also looking at the uh, the entrance road from Alfie Byrne Road to actually have a dedicated cycle lane in and we're also looking at extending the left-hand traffic lane uh, for the people turning left. Uh, 2020 is going to be the year of the East Point community. That is sort of where I'm coming from with this. The idea we have is with our new tennis and tennis and football courts, we're thinking about having an intercompany league, uh, a tournament for tennis, and some sort of a football league for companies in the park. If you're in a company and you have a team. You can put together a team and, and we'll have some sort of a competition where you take on other occupiers in the park or perhaps where you're in a smaller company you can put a team together with two or three other small companies and field a team for the thing it's just a bit of fun really but the idea would be that maybe there's some sort of an entry fee and the winner takes all and um, we we'll throw on some sort of a big booze up in the block burger um, at the end of the summer something like that anyway we're, we're thinking about it it'll probably run for eight or twelve weeks and um, the idea is that we have a leaderboard and it kind of goes down and there'll be a, a winner and there'll be a runner-up and there'll be I, I guess a number of prizes along the way for the highest score and things like that if this sounds of interest please let me know either comment below or send me an email you know my email at this stage uh, gavin at eastpoint.ie be delighted to hear what you have to say about that and just going to see if there's anything else on my list um, yes also just in general comments I always enjoy getting comments with suggestions Hannah thank you about the basketball hoop comment if you could also guys if you have any suggestions ideas um, was somebody uh, I think it was Eugene in cadence a couple of months ago he came up with an idea for shortening the uh, the rear uh, security gate so that the cyclists can come and go pretty quickly it took us a little bit of time because we actually had to get guys in to, to do it but that's now done it's now shorter so you can cycle through that at least that's what I hope and um, anyway any suggestions any kind of uh, ideas you have of ways we can improve I'm all ears so either put a comment below or send me an email and um, I hope you'll I'll be in touch with details about the podcast very soon. Um, I'd say it'll go live in the next week or two. And um, let me know if anyone wants to appear on the uh, one of the episodes of the podcast. I just think it's something that maybe you guys are be interested in, in hearing out. So, guys, nice to be back. Sorry it's taken so long. Hope to see you all very soon.